Hello there, my lumpies and my germs, all in my face, getting me very sick. How are we doing today? Well, we've kicked off with some bits already. Thank you so much, Checkpoint Couple, for 50 bits. Hey, up, cads. Hope life is treating you well. Looking forward to SpongeBob. Well, so am I. Thank you so much. Stu Sharp 93 has resubbed. Thank you so much. Um, Allison Inc, 100 bits, thank you so much. 500 bits from the classy one. Hey, Caddy, super excited for a spongy stream. All the best to everyone there. Hope Stan is feeling well. Um, yeah, he's, he's doing okay. In fact, he's doing so well, he's actively trying to break his leg again so he can go back to the hospital, um, which is, which is good. Uh, that, that's, that's great because he's just, he, he doesn't care and he wants to break his leg again. So that's something. Uh, what else have we got going on? We have got a resubscription from Scott Thunder. Um, Nam, Nam, Namine, Namine, Jamie, I think that says Namine, Jamie. Thank you for the subscription. And Cormonde or Comond, I'm not sure there. And Awemblin, thank you so much. Dredge and Bungo, 100 bits. Well, here's the 100 bits remaining in my account at present. Thank you so much. Infim, 1,000 bits. Jesus Christ. Um, bits to give, um, to give Rhea a shout out since she wants one. Okay, yeah, you guys have your, you, you have your 1,000 bit shout outs. That's your own little system you have there. I'm not endorsing more donations, but thank you so much. And Rathchard has subscribed, along with Drudge and Bungo, gifting two subs. Classy one, 100 bits. Glad to hear the sound effects back. Yeah, the sound effects are indeed back, because we're not doing a very serious, um, depressing, gruesome, horrible, gory stream anymore. We are now doing um, Spongebob. You know, a bit of whiplash. We're jumping from um, Joel from The Last of Us being murdered in cold blood to... Um, Patrick eating a watermelon. So th there we go. Um, fingers crossed. Fingers crossed it works. Because we tried... It says here, I first played this on August 14th. That's a lie. I didn't touch the game. The PC wouldn't let me. So I'm just fucking hoping. Shadowtail292. $10 donation. Thank you so much. Are you feeling it now, Mr. Caddy? What does that mean? Uh... <laughs> That's, a, that's the most ominous donation message I've ever received. Oh, thank you for the subscription, Johnny Viney and Twarfens. Very kind of you. Right, let's see if this... Let's see if this... I'll well, get the mouse out of the way. Let's see if this works. Oh, my goodness. Right, I'm going to need... By the way, if if, if anybody decides um, to say Spongebob references and shit... Yeah, does it sound okay to you? Is the volume okay, or do I need to turn it up a little bit? Yes, okay, game volume turned up, okay. God, these, okay, now this is going to be annoying, because now all the alerts are the... Ah, oh, fuck's sake, guys, sorry. This is this is why I don't stream. I'm not very good at it. Okay, wait a sec. So, the That's game audio... ...is apparently not... What? It's not even recognized as a what the fuck? That's how we do it in the garden. No, we don't want to do that. I've just duplicated the Oh fuck's sake. Oh this shit's so complicated. How do you guys stream? No, that's too loud. That's too that's too loud. Oh, Jesus Christ. Sorry, everyone. I'm, I am going to figure this out. As I always do. All I know is that those alerts are way too loud for me. So if I, if I have to turn up the, um, the speakers, which I will, then that means the alerts are going to be turned up, which means it's just going to be way too loud for everybody. So I'm just... If I go to the alert boxes... I don't know. For some reason, the alert box, as it on its own, doesn't seem to work. Um, 
I have to do it all within the same thing. I, I can't explain it. It's very difficult. It's been a long day. Oh, jeez. Okay, subscriptions. Sound volume. Yeah, that's way too loud. That's way too loud. But then that's going to be way too quiet, isn't it? Oh, fuck this shit. I still I still don't like... I'm, I'm either going to fuck around again or I'm not going to get onto a stream for the second time. So I'm... No, fuck this. I'm going to turn alerts off. But I can't because that's all linked into the fucking game. Oh my god, I hate streaming so much! What do I do? Fuck. Oh, why does this not work? This is so fucking stupid. This is so stupid. Okay, for some reason, the alert box volume is... It doesn't... What? So it's telling me that the volume for the alert box is not working. Oh my god, What? what is this shit? What is this? Monitor only? No. Monitor off. I think that's what that does. I'm not sure. Oh Jesus Christ, this is annoying. There's no way for me to mute any of the alerts without muting all of the game audio. But if I turn the game audio up, then the alert noises will be like... Like, they'll be distorted, they'll be so loud. So what do I do? <laughs> I, it doesn't want to give me s separate bits. Oh my god. Even... It, this is why I stopped fucking streaming on the Friday. Because I can't stream. <laughs> I, I don't know how any of this works. I don't know how any of this works. Oh, fucking hell. Oh, fuck it. I don't know. I don't get this shit. I do not get this shit. I'm sorry, guys. I'm going to need to just, um... Even if you only up the audio the audio in game. Uh, maybe. I'm not sure that would work, though. Let's see. Let's go to the options and have a look. Audio. Can I turn it up? No, they're all on max. Oh, fuck me. So all of that's on max. Oh, fuck. I don't know. I don't know. I'm, I'm, I'm at a loss. I can't, I can't stream with the alerts being like double the volume they should be. I can't lower my own audio. Oh wait, the game's louder in-game? Oh, fuck's sake. How are we gonna- No, alt-tab. Alt-tab. Alt-tab! Thank you. Okay, fuck it then. Fuck it, fuck it, fuck it. I'm gonna go back to where I was before. And we're just gonna have to hope that it works. This shit's ridiculous. Maybe it was just the- Maybe it was just the intro. Let's see. It might be ridiculously loud now. Welcome to Bikini Bottom. Oh, okay. Yeah, it's got a bit louder now. Well, then that was a huge waste of time. Welcome to the Kadikara streams. Where we spend 19 minutes fucking around, not playing the game, trying to solve a problem that doesn't exist. Well, wow, you, this is this is very delayed. What the fuck's going on here? It would help if he was talking with his mouth. This is the this is the problem I had on Friday. This is the problem I had on Friday. Fuck. Fucking hell. I can't keep doing this. Uh, 
Okay, wait. I, I've, I've, even, I've lost all my alerts. I can't even thank everybody. Oh, Jesus Christ. Thank you so much, Spartan Gamer, for the bits. Dotcaster bonus. Classy 150... 50 superset 80. In Flim. Subscriptions from Irish... Gro I don't know why the hell you'd want to subscribe in the last 19 minutes. Streaming experience level minus 20, says Iron Ninja with 100 bits. Yeah, you, you're not wrong there. Okay, well, anyway, let's just hope that this delay is just something in the cutscenes, because fuck. Wouldn't it be great if we had real robots to play with, Patrick? I'd name mine Robo Jr. Or Zorlon. Or maybe Frankie. Yeah, these unreal robots are getting boring. Is this normal? we put the robots in here? Oh, how shellfish of you. I, I, I. Not just any oh, someone one salty is saying that the jank is in the cutscenes. Wow, that's great, Patrick. So we put the toy it's not normal. Great. <sighs> Fuck's sake. We say the magic wishing words and shake the magic wishing this is really bad. Okay. This is really bad. Is this a steam thing? Aren't we going to say the magic wishing words? You already did. So, okay, is the magic wishing word? It used to be Alakazama, Alabala, Wisna, Tikitana, Fushbar, Griddle, Bits, Von, Vita, Schnauzer, but No, yeah, no it. detail should ever have been put that Are much into sure Patrick's work? tongue. Sure. Last week, I only had one big cookie crumb and I was really hungry. So I put my cookie crumb in the magic wishing shell. Then I said the magic wishing word and shook it. And in the morning, I had lots of little cookie crumbs. Patrick, I proclaim that tomorrow... <laughs> this delay is, is fucking day. dreadful. Good night, SpongeBob. What is night, this? Patrick. What's going on? The next morning... <laughs> oh. Texture popping. Wow, I knew he was going to be shocked before he said anything. Did you do that? Beer one one no, nah, beer one nine nine, hundred bits. At least we can see. <laughs> yeah, Gary. It sure looks like we're in a doozy of a pickle. I think. Thank I'm you for the thousand bits, Damien Castaway. Welcome to Pure business. Suffering. Also, Scooby doing the reluctant werewolf is a masterpiece. One could say it's batshit insane. I don't even know if that's a joke or not. Okay, so, okay, inputs are fine. Look, I press A, or X, rather, and that shit works. What a fantastic idea. Maybe it was just a cutscene thing. Will provide important tips to help me out. Um, yeah, do I don't know. It's, it seems to be working now. Oh, okay. Press this button to read the signs. Meow. So if I want to come back and That's talk to you again, again just garden. walk up to you and press this button. I'd better get started now, Gary. I think that this is going to be a very long day. So because I was spending all that time fucking around with stupid streaming shit, what's going on? <laughs> I guess in the, I guess in the, in the grand scheme of things it doesn't matter because it's a stupid SpongeBob story. But what's going on? <laughs> I'm exploring everywhere. What for? Okay, well at least it runs and looks great on Steam at least. Okay, we can spin. For anyone wondering, this is my first time properly playing this. I know a lot about it purely from YouTube videos and other people talking about it and looking at gameplay and shit. Never played it myself. I even own the original on Xbox and I haven't touched it. Planton makes robots stop robots win. Thank you. Oh my god, fuck's sake. Okay. I need more shiny objects to go to this area. Understood. Where am I going then? I hope this game isn't as difficult as the Fall Guys is with um, basic platforming and that guy being a little bitch about it. Okay, I can jump. That's all I... That's, that's fine so far. I've got 48 shiny things. Can I do something with it? Right a button. Note from Mr. Krabs. <sighs> and it even smells sweaty, just like him. <laughs> Ahoy there, SpongeBob. Oh, it's talking. As a faithful crew member of the Krusty Krab, you Well, that's not Cortex. Promoted to head shiny object collector. That's a bad impression. Wow, a promotion. That's a really, really That's bad right, impression. Considering that Clancy Brown so does games, I don't know why they didn't use him. Is you collecting all these shiny objects that the robots are leaving behind and bringing them to me? Now stop seahorsing around and get busy collecting. Well, it's 
SpongeBob Kazooie, I guess. Thank you for the five dollars, Rorschach one. It must be a pal problem. <laughs> yeah, I'm just gonna I'm just gonna go by that. It, everything is a pal problem. Everything. Right, so we haven't got fifty shiny things yet, but I've got more than ten. Pretty sure. Oh god, we can get pants. What do we do with them? Oh, they hit points. Yeah, it's a pair of SpongeBob's underwear, which implies that they're sponge genitals, which is the worst thing in the world. Every time he gets hit, yeah, okay, so it's it's okay. Right, he once he loses all of his underwear, he must start over again. I mean, yeah, if you lose your underwear, go home and get some new ones on. You don't just carry on like nothing happened. Three pairs of underwear, golden underwear, which allows SpongeBob to wear more than three pairs at a time. This is a deep mechanic, and it's pants. I didn't think that would ever be a thing. Oh, look, it's a show reference, which I don't know. Yeah, that was something else I was going to bring up as well. Oh, thanks, Times Apex, for the subscription. 100 bits from Iron Ninja. The audio is important from the original, like, medieval remake. Oh, okay. That's, well, they could have redone Clancy Brown, surely. Um, is that Mar from Home Alone? So, um, says the classy one of the 100 bits. I don't know. I couldn't tell you. But anyway, like I was going to say, all the pictures and references and things... I'm gonna own. I my knowledge of SpongeBob is base level. I know a few memes, and I remember seeing a few of the early season episodes. But I am far from a fanatic. I've seen the movie once, the first one, only once, and I remember David Hasselhoff in it, and that's it. Um, and the bit where Patrick and SpongeBob nearly die and become um, normal Sponge and normal Starfish. So I remember that, but that's 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 as deep as my knowledge goes, I'm afraid. So I'm really sorry if I don't understand some people's chats or like anything like that or anything in the game which I'm supposed to find hilarious and I don't. Oh. Okay, we get a combo. All right. That's a get that's a gex switch in the 3D gex games. Hmm. This is where I keep all my old comic books. You wanna say that again? I love opening presents. You wanna say it again? No? Good. I have a feeling this game's gonna be great with the audio. Right, is there some sort of wait, okay. Uh okay, let's read some shit. Okay, press B in midair. Okay, right. Uh gotcha. Damien Castaway, 100 bits. This is where I keep all my old comic books! Trouble with the trolley, eh? Okay, right. So what do we do with these jokers? On the ground and then we'll do a bubble bash attack and smash tiki's or robots or directly above. Okay, right, that makes sense. That's a cool attack. Oh, it's like his hat, he gets a bubble helmet. That's nice. I like. So far the game feels great to play. It's really smooth. I mean, not even just performance and visual wise, but like the controls are great. I don't know if I was supposed to be able to do that, but I just jumped on this bit here. Yeah, I think they wanted me to use the, the this here, and that that didn't work at all. So, sorry about that. But I think I am going to use this to get to this switch over here. Thunder THR, 100 bits. Did you get a haircut or is your, your camera angle? Oh, it's just my... It's camera angle plus heat plus... Yeah, I'm just a sweaty mess right now. The UK is not very fun. It's, not, it's cooler, but it's still very humid. And I've just come out of my office after filming some, um... Uh, like, you know the spinny shots I do in my videos? Oh, that we're timed. We're timed, 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 timed. Okay. Yeah, the spinny shots that I do in my videos. Where do I start? Oh, I see. Right. I doubt I'm going to make it, but, you know. I might just do it. Can I... Well, what was the point of that one? Oh, I see. They wanted me to start on that one, didn't they? I don't know. I think I got everything. Pretty sure. Yeah, I think we're good. Thank you to the $5, Steve the Weave. I played the demo of this game so many times way back in the days when I was young. Yeah, I never did. Um, I feel like I missed out. Because this this game is like everything I like about 3D collectathon kind of games. What's that, sorry? Oh, Amy missed... Yeah, Amy's not here right now. She'd be sad she missed Steve the Weave. Thank you... Re re rectum. 
Rectisipic? I'm sorry, I can't read that from here. You've gifted a sub. That's very kind of you. Sorry for fucking your name up. I can't see. Um, Bland John, 1996, 100 bits. My head is starting to hurt trying to think of something clever. Uh, meow. I know meow is a Gary thing. So I got that. I'm doing good. Oh god, Sponge, are you going to do that every time you pick up one of these golden spatulas? Ah, nice visual gag here. Nope, can't do anything with them. Alright, that's fine. So, does the game want me to go... Oh, I haven't been here yet. Ah, uh, right, okay. You guys alright? Time for tutorial. Oh, does that mean I did everything? Pressing right trigger. Okay. Patrick's locks, lost socks. Underwear. Okay, right. Okay, so that's my heads up display. That sounds good. Oh, look, it's more references that I don't get. Um, oh, goodness, guys. You guys are being way too kind. Um, we've got Spiker Jagger with 100 bits. I remember playing this so much that at one point I was supposed to watch my brother who was a baby at the time and pour shampoo on the carpet in my parents' bedroom. <laughs> well, you did that. And then your brother told on you when he was a baby. Or the, your baby brother did that. Um, edible Knees, thank you so much for coming back. 245 bits. What are your favourite trees? Um, I don't know. Um, I suppose um, I like uh, palm trees. I like palm trees. And which of them is the best kisser? Oh, you did a lol random on me. I see. I feel like I've missed some shiny objects. 95 is a horrible fucking number to leave on. Is there five shiny bits where I couldn't see? Did I miss something? Mm, I mean, I might, it might be fine, but mm, this doesn't feel right. It feels like there should be there, there should be more. Anything up here? No. I make myself a snack, but there's no time. Uh, okay. Pretty sure this I scoured I this room. I mean, I might be going nuts. I think uh, maybe there aren't a hundred shiny objects in here, but it would seem weird if it wasn't. Okay, I'm gonna just. Oh. Oh, I see. Oh, I okay. Oh, you're gonna just hang there. Can we just keep fish face on the screen for forever? Never reading the news. Oh my goodness. Oh, guys, you're being too nice. I can't keep up with all your fucking bits. Ah! Um. And I can't, I can't even scroll. I'm sorry. Okay, I'm gonna miss a load of shout outs. I'm so sorry, but that like my screen, unless I keep leaving the game and going back onto my other screen, I can't see like the history of who cheers and shit. So I'm just gonna need to get better at this. I'm sorry. Um, Manic Realms 100 bits. Thank you so much. I mean Leafeon. Thank you so much for 100 bits. The speedrunning community for this game is great. A big reason why I got a remake in the first place. You should check out the, um, a run when you get the chance. They're insane. Will do. Thank you. Bih199. 100 bits. This game is Footloose and Crash combined and Bandicoot but other things later. Okay. Harper Onions. Hello. How are you doing? 200 bits. The voice actor for Mr. Krabs and I think Mermaid Man weren't available for the original voice recording. Well, they must have been available now. What was Clancy Brown doing? Fucking, um, um... No, I was going to say he wasn't. He couldn't have been doing um, Detroit Become Human because that had already been done. Damien Castaway, 100 bits. Got a question to all. Do you prefer pound cake, ice cream cake, or cheesecake? I don't know what pound cake is. What's pound cake? No, that you don't know either. That must be an Americanism. Sorry, don't know. Ice cream cake, I've never had. So I'm just going to have to go by cheesecake by default. Uh, Manic Realms, 100 bits. Don't, for um, don't forget. No, don't forget to fill up those idle animations for a laugh. Oh, okay. Thanks for the resubscription, so Puka Bound. Fixing this quietly. <laughs> Authorities are not sure who is responsible for unleashing the mechanical. Thanks for the 50 bits, Platinum Warp Star. They have assured us that the person is in big, big trouble. Mm-hmm. Uh-oh. Did I say big trouble? I meant so enormous that it's hard to comprehend trouble. We'll keep you posted as this tragic story unfolds. Tragically, we're sure. 
Well, we found out some interesting shit there. Um, oh, goodness, guys, you're being too nice. I can't keep up. I'm sorry if I missed some shit. Um, very curious to see what you think about this game besides the bad syncing in the opening cutscene. Out of curiosity, would you replay Bloodborne on your own if it was ba backwards compatible with PS5? I'd replay it anyway. I don't need it. A fucking backwards compatibility. Birthday cake is pound cake, says Damien Castaway. Oh, well, yeah, birthday cake rocks, but I think I'd have to go for cheesecake. 500 bits from Aaron the Wolf. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Oh, no, that's nothing. Hey, Kenny, hope you and your family have been doing alright. You're still one of my favourite YouTubers right now. Thank you so much, Aaron the Wolf, but even though you can't be. Wait. Okay, am I missing something? Why is SpongeBob screaming? Give me some credit, Gary. I remember. Yeah. Is there just I I guess there's just no shiny things. I I guess. I don't know. I've I've been in every room. Go away, SpongeBob. You're polluting my thinking space. Trying to steal the Krabby Patty formula again, eh, Plankton? Well, you won't get away with it. I've got bigger fish to fry. I've got to figure out how to regain control of the chum bucket from those robots. <laughs> I just realized. Cum bucket. Where did they come how from? did they get away with that? Okay. Yes, but it's pretty much... I don't know what chum is, but the point is, is that they've... But they've put bucket and chum next to each other. And cum bucket is a thing. Yeah. Um, they must have known. Not for me though, that's for sure. They just showed up out of nowhere and started calling me. Bland John 1996. I hope my ugliness doesn't affect your enjoyment of this game. I can't see you, so it won't. Kermit Wazowski, 50 bits. Thank you so much. Bit off of Bikini Bottom is one of my favorite guys of all time. To see, uh, decide to see what you think of it. And Lamarski 84 has subscribed. Thank you so much. Plankton's having a moment. Um, his arms are really un making me uncomfortable. Ooh, they're like. Uh, like umbilical cords. Oof. Oh. That's terrible. Oh, won't you help me stop them before they bend all my forks? Not the forks. Of course I'll help. But wait, I'm supposed to collect a whole lot of golden spatulas. Golden spatulas, eh? SpongeBob, if you could get me back into the chum bucket, I'll give you a bucket full of golden spatulas. <laughs> I give you a bucket full of cum. Thank you so much, Classy One, for the hundred bits. You've got a deal. Right now, we know he's the baddie, so can we do anything right now? We can smack him in the face. That's a good start. But that's all we can do. The game would be really short if we could just end it right now. <laughs> Oh god, you can link them together! Oh, that's great. This is a very pretty game. I like the way it looks. Oh god. Hey, not Mr. Krabs. SpongeBob, what are you doing here? The robot crisis is making the Krusty Krab lose money like a sinking ship. No money means no more Krusty Krab. That's a no terrible impression. Krab means no more fry cooking for you. Big Ratchet and Clank remake vibes, says Meerkat Doken. Classy 100 bits, come and eat the cum bucket. That was the joke indeed. Thank you. But because you're gullible, I'm going to help you out. And of course, make a small profit in return. I've got a few golden spatulas that I'll be willing to trade to you for some of those shiny objects. Okay. All right. Let's do let's do some shit. Yeah, I know. We you just told me that. Okay, we're jumping push, over push, to Squidward's push, push, push. house. Okay, oh, wait, 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 wait. Okay, we gotta go now, like right now. Um, how do we, what? How do we, how? Okay, I clearly haven't got the means to do this just yet, have I? Unless I do and I'm just being stupid. Nope, I don't I don't know what I'm doing there just yet. I'm sure it'll come it'll show it'll make itself clear as we go on. There we go. Damien Castaway, 85 bits. Remember, Clancy Brown also played the head guard on the Shawshank Redemption. Very versatile actor. Yes, he did. Yeah, I've got nothing against Clancy Brown. I think he's an awesome guy. <laughs> what? Okay, A, that was incredible. B, what the fuck just happened? Did I go out of bounds? 
Jesus, like, this game's a headache. I just start. Oh. I just dropped by to give you a bubble hand. Where the hell did you come from? You see, you're going to need to learn some new bubble blowing moves if you're going to journey to the ninth dimension and defeat the giant monkey man. But uh, all I need to do is figure out how to get rid of these robots. Oh, yeah. Sorry. I've been in the soap bottle a little too long. Uh, where were we? Uh, something about new bubble moves. Oh, is right. this where the infamous Press bowling ball button, comes in? 100 bits from Bland John 1996. When you get to Squidward, jump around, jump around, jump up and get down. Above you. Try it out. So you've told me... Yeah, I've been told three times in a row that move now. Right, so now it would make sense to do this. Now I can get on top of Spongebob's house. Now I understand. No, don't leave! Come on. I haven't got all day. Come on. Uh, uh, golden undies. And a spatula. Good start. Yep, he's going to do that every time we pick one of these things up. I cannot wait for that to get annoying. Right, so we can't go that way. Oh, I see. So this is the edges of the play area, and we have to go down the roads to get to each location. So this is like the hub world. Right, right, right. So that was out of bounds. So if I do jump here... Yeah. That's, that's such a good, like, resetting death animation. That's fantastic. Oh, uh, great. Thank you so much, Doodles2345, for the subscription. Oh, shit. That was explosive. Oh, no, it wasn't. It was thundering like... Okay, no. He's, he's done his thing already. Okay. I missed. Let's try that again. Yay! Oh, what was that about? Okay, they vanish. They vanish when you get too close or when they see you? I think when you get too close. Oh, no, it's when they see you. Because if you jump... Nope, my miss. Nope. I don't know if I broke the game then or if I was supposed to do that, but I did it. So you get more shiny things... I, I'm, assume, I'm assuming that the shiny things just kind of exist. I don't. I think they're just currency. I don't think you have to collect a certain number of them, if I'm right in thinking. Which is great. That's how we do it hey, Patrick. <laughs> I could just do this all day. He's he's a very bouncy body, isn't he? Thank you so much for the gifted subs, Damien Castaway. Yuri Leclerc, thank you so much for the resub. Your streams have been a great comfort during some bad depression episodes. Thank you for providing laughs. Thank you so much for being so selfless and saying that. That's really kind of you. Thank you. Alright, can we go inside Squid's house? Yeah, we can. First, those stupid robots ruined a perfectly relaxing mud bath this morning. And now you show up. Can my day get any more dreary? I am so sorry, Squidward. Patrick and I were just playing a game and... Oh, I so correct I myself. My I should have known that whole robot problem involved both of you. Squidward, I don't know what to do. How can I fix everything? Why don't you move to another town? That should uh. help out more than enough. <laughs> <laughs> move to another town. I, I cracked me up. <laughs> but seriously, just jump around like an idiot. That should at least make me smile. <laughs> I didn't know Squidward Squid had a lamp. Yeah, Squidward, Squidward has got some deep underlying issues. And he's got a picture of himself blown up by 20 times on his wall. So he's a bit of a narcissist. Oh! Bit of a narcissist. Um, and I've given him a tash. Okay, okay, okay. Just stop oh, jumping, right. will you? If you take this golden spatula, will you please go away? <laughs> See, Squidward, I knew that you could help me out. You're the best. So is this one of these situations where the golden spatulas are needed to beat the game and yet everyone has them? It's a Super Mario Sunshine situation. Come on. 
Can we smash everything? Well, Squidward, I'm loving your, um... Your flat... Ornaments. What? Are they supposed to be, like, jars? Is that really bad graphics or a reference? I'm not sure. Oh, that's handsome Squidward. I know that one. Um, Squidward has... What? He's clearly murdered other members of his species, and he's now sticking their heads on the walls, so that's dark. Yep, just smash everything. Bye-bye painting. Bye-bye music stand. Oh, it's a sock. Hey, you. Patrick needs to do laundry. Can I smash that? No, I'll just smack him in the head. I mean, I, I can do that all day. Thank you so much, RJFLA, for the resubscription. Got it on Switch recently, and I'm enjoying it. I got it on Switch as well. For my spare time. This is work play. Yes. Right, can we go inside Patrick's house is the question. Yeah, well, the answer is we can. Living it is no longer the question. Now that's the light. Okay. Nice. Oh, he's, a, he's, a, he's very simple, but very sweet. All he needs is a chair and a picture of him and his friend. <laughs> That's all he needs. Oh! Ah, well done, platformer gaming instincts. Was that a flutter jump? Can I flutter jump? No, it just looks like he is because he's flapping his arms around. Okay, right. Right, so we need to go this way then. There's nowhere else we can go. We've explored everywhere. Um, I'll talk to Mr. Krabs and see if he can give me any golden spatulas. Treasure chests looking a bit light, boy. <laughs> Do you think I've Hello, I am Mr. Krabs. I am definitely the same voice actor. Ah, the rolling green hills of jellyfish fields. A place to experience this looks really nice most raw and sometimes a bit tender from the stings okay the 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 episode with the jellyfish is one that I've seen probably the most. So if there's any references here, I probably might see them. Squidward, are you okay? <laughs> no, I'm not okay, you barnacle head. Do I look like I'm okay? Well, your nose does look pretty big. I mean, bigger than usual because it's usually pretty big. And you look <laughs> clammy. And oh my gosh, you're bald! Mm. Oh Jesus, that's horrifying. <laughs> His mouth is open so wide. <laughs> <laughs> the grass is clipping through the back of his head. <laughs> oh, jeez. Classy 100 bits. It's Ned Cortex. Yes, you're right. It's not Neo. It's Ned. Damien Castaway, 115 bits. Caddy is more convincing Clancy Brown than this crabs. Oh, I wasn't even trying. Well, Maybe that's the joke. Fisher field manual, severe jellyfish stings can be treated effectively by applying a thick layer of king jellyfish jelly to the affected areas. <laughs> King j j jellyfish Well, I guess you're off the scale Sport Mountain and die a horrible death under the vicious tentacles of King Jellyfish. Thanks for the 100 bits, Cracks T. <laughs> I need to head to bit I need I'll to head to here. bit so here's some Over beds. Here I need to head to bed so here's some bits. We'll watch the rest tomorrow. Thank you so much. It will be on YouTube. My second you channel. Do that. Don't worry, Squidward. I'll bring back that King Jellyfish jelly for you to rub all over yourself. <laughs> Oh my good lord, how did they get away with some of this shit? What's the age rating on this game? I mean, obviously it's a kid's game, but like, if it was a 3 plus, I'd be surprised. 7 plus, I probably would have said. But then anything that has fighting in it is considered cartoonish violence, so they have to make it a 7 plus anyway. Alright, I can hit the jellyfish no problem. It's almost like I'm catching them because of the net. This is goo. Blue goo. Gooey gooey. It's 
SpongeBob and Patrick can't swim, so don't let them fall in the goo. They're underwater. Right. Yeah, I think I think yeah, I'm pretty sure that's just currency, isn't it? It's a teleport box. If you have them open, you can teleport between them. That's useful. How do I open them? Smack them? Nope, just walk up to them. Okay. All these rockets are very ominous. It makes me feel like we're going to be like nuked in a second. I don't like it. We can't jellyfish today. I'm going fishing for robots. Right, let's go up here. Oh, jeez! Like a spring breeze. Wee! I missed. There we go. Ultra combo. Mega combo. I feel like a new sponge. Maybe, maybe you don't get more currency based on how quickly you smash everything. Nothing's putting up a fight so far, which is fine. Let's see where we let's see where we end up in a few minutes. Fresh, like a spring breeze. Oh fuck! God, you're right. They can't swim. Okay. Thank you, Damien Castaway, for 100 bits. So, SpongeBob and Patrick can't swim. For creatures that live that can swim like whales, wouldn't they technically be flying in the SpongeBob microverse? I don't know. I guess. I guess. I mean, I know there's different densities of water, so I guess you could. Why am I? Why am I justifying this? It's stupid. I can't explain it. It's ridiculous. Ah, fuck it. Do the Y attack. Oh. 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 There we go. Anything on the beach? No! Oh! There was something on the beach. Captain Bird's Eye's very realistic, scary looking hand. Okay, right. Oh, we can sneak. It makes sneaking noises. With this music, this is just the most- oh fuck, this is just the most horrifying thing. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, I need 125 shiny objects, which I do definitely have, pretty sure. God, it's nice to play something like this after The Last of Us Part 2. That was draining after a while. Okay, there's a load of them over there. I'm wondering why. Aha! Got you. Right, what's around here? I don't even think SpongeBob's moving speed is a little slow. It's a, it's a bit slow. I think I'll get used to it. Ah, right. Oh, we've got some... Oh, there's a spatula down there. So how does this work? I'm, on, I'm gonna assume right here, right now, this is a bad idea. Yeah, it's a bad idea. Okay, so something has to happen in this area for that to be safe. So I'm gonna just keep going and then we'll see what happens. Cooper Trooper 621, thank you so much for the 100 bits. Chum is ground up fish, which is why no one eats it. You know, yeah, that's Keris did say that. I, I do know what chum is, I just thought it was funny how. The word chum and, you know, it rhymes and it has bucket underneath it. Afterneath it? This is why I shouldn't stream at night. I don't know what the hell I'm talking about. Ah. Oh god, we got Damon Castaway with 100 bits. Thank you so much. SpongeBob has cleared classic mode and is ready to fight Master Hand. However, Master Hand was just on a cruise and is now very angry that Spongy Boy isn't playing by the rules of the boundaries. Yes, absolutely. Just Another one. Awesome. Yeah, it's probably something I need to do in order for that to work, so... Classy 100 bits, thank you so much. Are you sure? Sneaking in boxes, are you sure this isn't Metal Gear Sponge? Yes, most likely. Liquid Sponge, that's the worst name ever. Is it as bad as Naked Sponge, though? Venom sponge. Well, I, yeah, I figured checkpoints were checkpoints. Thanks for letting me know that checkpoints were checkpoints. 
Give me a lot of hit points around here. I don't I don't I don't need them. Thank you so much, Manic Rounds for 100 bits. Too bad they didn't include the Super Sponge death sounds. This that would push it to 100 out of 10. <laughs> Fun fact, that is exactly what happens every single time one of my children gets kicked in the head. That noise happens. Leprechaun, thanks for the 100 bits. Cool, the bottom of my bikini reminds me of the good old times playing Revenge of the Flying Dutchman. Enjoy the game and take some bits. I will take your bits, Leprechaun, if you don't mind me um, looking at your cont. Um, Cooper Trooper 621, 100 bits. No, you've already, I've already, I've already said thank you to that one. Shiniest meat unicycle has resubbed. Thank you so much. Um, my god. Oh, army of... Army of rabid rats. Thank you so much for the 100 bits. No, no, I'm not being mean. That's what it says. Hey, Daddy Caddy. Just wanted to say hey, and thanks for all the years of amazing content. Remember to drink your milk. I I haven't drunk in milk in ye ages, actually. I have it in lots of things. Like, we, we cook it in a lot of things, but I haven't, I haven't drunk, like, a... No, we don't. Oh, you don't cook with milk at all? Well, then the last time I had milk was probably when I was when I was a smelly teenager then. Okay. Oh, no, it wouldn't have been because... No, it wouldn't have been because I, I filmed myself in videos recently drinking milk. So that's, that's rubbish. Wait, sorry, I, I, I wasn't even reading that. Freezy fruit. Only Patrick can use it. Okie dokie. That's probably to get across all of this goopy shit, isn't it? That's my guess. And that's probably how we're going to reach that golden spatula over there. So I've got to remember about that. Thank you so much. Um, oh, it's Rectum again. Thank you so much for the 100 bits. Sorry, I can't I can't read your name from here. I'm sorry. It's really complicated. The music in the David Hasselhoff, David Hasselhoff scene, if the SpongeBob movie was also in the ref, in a Reflections game on the PS... Sorry, I wasn't looking. Reflections game on PS2 called Stuntman. Oh, okay. Reflections as in um, um, the same people that did Driver. Acid Sugar, 100 bits, thank you so much. Me and my dog are relaxing to the stream, so thanks for streaming today despite difficulties. By the way, what are your thoughts on The Last of Us 2? Did you like it? Thank you so much for enjoying my shitty gameplay and my terrible setup and how I don't actually know what I'm doing, and because of that, anybody could do this better than me, so you probably should. Um, I liked, I liked Last of Us 2, I liked it a lot. The more I've been going about it in my head, I think I'd give it a 7. It was good. It, like... The drama surrounding it is so fucking overblown and ridiculous. I don't think it deserved a 10 in any stretch of the imagination, and I also do not think it deserved a 1 in any stretch of the imagination. Not to say it was, like, oh, half good, half bad. It was more good than bad, but I'd give it a solid 7 all in all. Biggest problem, I thought it was too bloated. It was so fucking huge, really slow-paced. And it was exhausting by the time I was done with it. So all the other little flaws just kind of compiled on top of it. Okay, that was uh, that was a reason to go. Thank you so much. Titty McGee has resubbed. Thank you so much. And Lamaski84, 5,000 bits. Fucking hell, thank you so much. I don't think... If, if any stream deserved 5,000 bits, it isn't this one! Oh, Jesus Christ, that's horrible. This is so... This is scary. I'm smashing up gnawing teeth, smiley wooden faces while there's giant fucking puffer fish that are gonna kill me. This is horrible. Oh. Oh, 100 bits from Okay, it's all it's RCT3. Um Roller Coaster Tycoon 3. Right, Roller Coaster Tycoon 3 is epic. That's what your name is, not Rectum. Thanks for clearing that up. From here, all of it being lowercase, I can't fucking make that out. Thanks for clearing it up. Now I won't make that horrible mistake again, or should I just keep calling you Rectum because it makes me giggle? I feel like a new sponge. I like how you say that after you just got smacked in the face by a poisonous puffer fish, but alright. Yeah, this walking speed is a little too slow for my liking. This is quite ploddy. Can I hit these things? No, they can hit me though. Okay, yep. Yeah. Okay. Nice and straightforward so far. More ballistas. Yeah, I was going to say, you should, should have been able to destroy that. Oh, hey, Gary. 100 bits, thank you so much. In from Inflim. 
So are you saying the game was infected with so much story it was bloated and you were shambling through the game? Yeah. <laughs> yes, and it really clicked me off. Wow! A bungee jump for a golden spatula! I must be in heaven! Okay. What does this do? Oh, this isn't going to end well, is it? Oh, so this is how I'm going to get the golden spatch. Right. So I need to get Patrick to freeze the water over there. Oh, I see. He uses the... Right. He uses his pants. Okay, right. There we go. Yeah, thanks, SpongeBob. Ah, uh, very, very... You know, of all the, like, the talk I saw about this game, nobody mentioned, like, that it looked as nice as it does. Maybe it's, maybe on the consoles it looks a bit worse, but on PC it looks fucking gorgeous. I, I saw people saying it looked good, I just, like, this is really good looking for, like, this kind of game, taking a 2D cartoon and 3 d izing it. Thank you, Damien Castaway, for another 100 bits. He uses his pants, that must be the only context where the sentence isn't weird. Oh god, no, there's tons of things that you could say for that. People could use um, make a, a hammock out of their pants, and then you could say, oh, you use your pants. Or, like, you could be shocked to hear that somebody doesn't wear pants, and then you find out they do one day, and then you say, oh, wow, you use your pants. There's other ways you could say that and have it not sound weird. Right. What's the bet? This is a one-hit kill enemy as well. Not for me, but for it. Yeah, <laughs> I, I expected as much. I love opening presents. How are you doing, dude? You're looking quite... You look like you've seen some shit. You all right? Allow me, allow me to just make your day worse. Yeah! Animation resetting. Yeah! So that means I can do this all day. No, I go straight through you. Uh, thanks thanks for bouncing back up again because this makes it all the more satisfying when I do this. Are you alright? I'm a bit I'm a bit worried for you. Are you okay? Just my size. Okay. Can we go down here? Or is it gonna take tell me to go? Nope. Alright. Uh Manic Realms, thanks for the fifty bits. You are indeed play the best possible version of this game. The switch port is the worst performing from what I've seen. I'm not even talking about performance, I just mean generally. Like, it's a really good looking game, and none of the coverage I've seen have really... Oh, he's clapping me. Thank you. <laughs> um, yeah, nobody has gone in, like that crazy over the visuals, which is weird because it's it's really good looking. I thought it would have had taken more precedence, honestly. Super monster combo. Okay. Hey, there we go. And what's here? Ah, it's taking us up here to... I don't know what that is. So I'm leaving it because I'm frightened of it. Thanks for the other 100 bits, Damien. Those robots have meat fists. Oh, I see. I see Skittles. We know what that means, don't we? Oh. Uh, how are we supposed to bowl the ball when SpongeBob moves forward in the middle of the bowling animation? How, guys? How? Yeah, we don't know how to do that shit yet. Anything around here, though, I can grab? Kind of difficult to tell what the game considers out of bounds or not. Like, cause I, by looking at that there, I would have figured that that wasn't. I would, I, yeah, here. I thought this would be out of bounds. But I bet if I go down another level, it will tell me I'm out of bounds. Yeah, this is weird. Ah, sorry, I'm just getting a cushion for my back. Cause I'm hurting. Oh, that's better. Oh, okay, so if I ever go out of bounds, I, I die automatically and have to get all of this shit all over again. Oh, that's gonna get fun, isn't it? Oh, okay. 
I've got to be more careful about where I go. But I can't be careful because I don't know where the game considers out of bounds or not. That's quite difficult to figure out, actually. Yeah, I got my same super monster combo. Angelic Arax, thanks so much for coming down with your 100 bit. Good evening, Caddy. Wonderful stream to come home to after training newcomers all day at the office. Oh, hope that went well. I remember I, cho well, one, before I, before I, um, did any youtube -y stuff, I was, um, actually hired, well, it was unpaid, but I was hired without being paid as, um, somebody to train a load of, like, late 20s and early 30-year-olds in Sony Vegas, which was Sony Vegas at the time, it's not Sony anymore, but... Yeah, I was like 17 and I was called in because I had more experience than most of the the guy that was running this this course um, He didn't have much. He had a lot of experience with like TV level editing equipment, but not Professional home editing equipment. Wait, how do we get up there? Okay yeah, he had a lot of experience with like professional TV um, editing equipment, but nothing when it came to um I don't think I can get up here. No, I'm going to need to get up there first. Yeah. Um, no, no experience with, like, home-brewed. Home-brewed? That's not the word. But, you know, like, commercialised um, editing equipment. So I was brought in to their London offices to teach them. And it was the worst thing I think I've ever done. I appreciate the opportunity. And I did get my foot in the door with TV. I met the, um, the head executive at the time of um, uh, Channel 4, I think. In the UK, at least. That doesn't mean anything to someone who doesn't live in this country. So that was fun. But, yeah, that was horrible. That was absolutely horrible. Not because nobody knew what they were doing, but because I was treated like I didn't know what I was doing. Which is funny, because I was teaching. It's like, well, at the end of the day, guys, you don't know what you're fucking doing. So you can you can be upset that a 17-year-old is teaching you, but the point, the point is, is that you still can't do the thing. So you can be pissy about it, or you can let me teach you. So I had to quit because they were being fucking bitches all the time and I couldn't handle it. I've told you that story loads of times. Oh, they were nasty. Yeah, they were really nasty. Yeah. This is goo. Yeah, we can't swim in goo. Yeah, we, fa we found that out earlier. That's fine. Oh, they are meat fists. I thought they were just metal. Just yeah. Um, just to get a hit point? So in order to get a hit point back, you've got to do pretty risky platforming. That's counterintuitive. No! Oh my jeez. I was trying to hit that one at the end. I'll grab the blue shiny object. That's putting you under a lot of pressure just to get a hit point back. Like, if you died, you would have gone all the way back to... Actually, no, we had a checkpoint not that long ago, didn't we? Thank you for the 100 bits, Damien. I thought you ra I thought I randomly shouted meat fists. That hurts, Caddy. Yeah, you, you did, but I didn't know what you meant. So I couldn't, I couldn't respond, but now I know what you mean. Right, so now we can go this way. Oh, Jesus Christ. Okay. Can I not look down? The camera's not moving down. I've just got to guess where I am. Oh, jeez. This is horrible. Uh, yep. Okay. I haven't fallen off yet. And across a little bit more. Stop. Oh, fucking hell. This is horrible. I can't see where I'm going. Ah, done it. Smelly sock is my reward. Patrick doesn't even wear socks. Why are we doing this? Right, what does this do? Oh, that's the bungee line, isn't it? What happens if I smack it? No, nothing. Okay, fine. Boing, 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 boing. Wow, those air trails. Gaming is the future. Where's the next checkpoint? Ah, oh, we've got a teleportation box. Nice. But that doesn't really help right this second. So, Duplicotatron 1000, which means that I have to destroy it, right? Yep, that's fine with me. I can do that. Oh, fuck! <laughs> okay. 
It blew up in my foos. Okay, right. Let's continue. Oh, there's a Gex switch. Nice. That was loud. Jesus. Yeah, spatula for my cratula. Oh, I see. So this is the end of this area. Right, got you. I like how the like the, the 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 screen changes, then the bubbles come up, which should be the loading screen, and then it loads afterwards. Oh god, I can hear his teeth grinding from here. Um, so yeah. What? Oh. I haven't seen enough of the Mermaid Man and Barnacle Boy stuff to know the difference of the voices, so I'm sorry I can't I can't be as upset as other people are. That Patrick is surrounded by robots and needs my help. Oh no. I think it had something to do with massaging my feet. Well, if massaging your feet will save Patrick, then massage I must. Help! They're making me hit myself! <laughs> massaging your feet isn't working. I think I'd better try a more direct approach. By clipping my toenails? Here I come, Patrick! Okay, so I was just thinking... Is there a way for me to see... Yeah, there is. There is a tally. Okay, right. And it tells me what the missions are. Oh, and I can travel to them. Okay. So there's 14 socks in this area. So at some point, I'm going to not have all of them. And then I need to work out which one I was missing, right? Oh, it's a slide. Okay, here we go. We Mario 64-ing. He's using his tongue. That is disgusting. Oh, we can still double jump. Sweet. Oh, Sponge, no. Come on. That was a ton of fun. I should do it again sometime. It shines. I love opening presents. Ah, uh, that's another box. So if I jump in here, where does it take me? Back to the beginning? Sweet. Let's do it again. I don't know if I missed something important. There seem to be like... Ah, right. Ha ha ha! I know your tricks, game. Ah, and another sock! Okay, I just jumped from like four to eight. How did I do that? Are they in bundles? Oh, okay. I'm not about to question. Right, so can we reset that checkpoint? No, it's it's activated automatically. Okay. You need to get to Patrick to help him, but he's unreachable. Maybe he switches will create a way. The robots are guarding them heavily. You'll have to battle through. Yes, I will. I'll battle through Bikini Bottom. <laughs> okay, right. Wow. Like this is some intense music, bro. I'm feeling the pressure. If only Last of Us 2 used this music. Okay, now I know those explode, so I need to stay away from that shit. On my face! Boom, boom, boom. Nope, okay, you got me first. Fair enough. Touche. Boom. Now, where's the rest of... Where's the duplicator Tronobotter fucker? Oh, it's up there. Okay. All right, let's end this shit. Well, it's just one hit on those things. I need to remember that. It's one hit for everything, isn't it? There we go. And smack and smack. I don't even know if I've got like a lot of shiny things. I seem to have quite a few. Right, I see. Also, I just noticed there was an animation that's different when you're running away from an enemy, which was quite funny. Okay, I'm full of health now. Full of health. And ready to spread my wealth. Okay. Uh, oh! <laughs> okay, let's go this way then. Hey, Pat. Thank goodness you're safe, Patrick. Well, of course, SpongeBob. 
Why wouldn't I be? Well, the robots and the... Oh, yeah, I found this for you. <laughs> I don't know what it is, but it looks important. Thanks, Patrick. I tell you what, all that running around has left me pooped. Why don't you continue on for a bit? Yes, because he's clearly in the physical state to do okay. that. Oh, no, he's all right. Oh, boy, oh, boy, oh, boy. Oh god, he's a okay. So Pat Patrick is the is the tubby fuck of the group. So he he's he he moves even slower. Pretty sure. Oh, that's a good move though. That's a good move. I like that move. It is a throw foot. A throw foot. Oh. Throw fruit. You can pick up throw fruit and throw them. Oh, can you? Press the B button to pick it up. It destroys shit and it explodes after a few seconds. Obviously, why? What else would it do? Okay, so I can do like this weird right. Okay. I thought he would be like he would use his weird penis hands to do something. Can I aim it at that? No! I I hit it somehow. Wow. Oh shit. Well, I just, well, I just ruined that, so I can't pick these up. Oh, I can. Okay. Ah, that's nice. Okay, you, are you a friend? Oh, no! Oh. Bye, Patrick. That was the end of the game. That was a bit, and like, that wasn't a very good fanfare, was it? I really need to get sorted with a stream deck, don't I? So I can, um... So I can do death noises and shit. Hey, that worked! Yeah, are you a friend or what? Okay, yeah, you are because you don't die. What are you doing up here? I'm assuming you'll get, you'll become useful as it goes on. I, I'm not sure. Okay, right. Oh, we've got a bus stop. So we can, ah, oh, so we can swap characters. Okay. So that means, hang on a sec. So if I'm Patrick right now, I mean, it's going to take me a while, but if I'm Patrick right now, I should be able to backtrack through the um, teleportation box. All the way back to the slide. And then get that, um, that other thing that we missed earlier. In the, um, jellyfish fieldy bit. This bit back here. Hey, mermaid man. <laughs> oh, God. Okay, right. Let's go this way, then. So I should be able to... Yep, okay. I was correct in my assumption. Okay, they respawn, which is kind of annoying, but I suppose that keeps the game interesting. So that means... Oh, hang up, I missed that. Oh, shit. Oh, good thing I came back. How do I get up there? Oh, God, Patrick's so heavy, he can't even get on a seesaw. Okay, right. How do I get up there? robot <laughs> Uh, I mean, it's probably Spongebob that's the better one to do this, but no, I can't do this. Did I, mi did I miss some, like, obvious platform or something? Shut up! Go away! I'm going to try and keep away from the chat with stuff like this, just to let you know, because I don't, I don't like having it, having the answer being told to me. I like to have the game's design and everything do the talking for me. Otherwise, like, then it's, if I'm just doing shit what people tell me to do, then I can't, I can't judge the, the quality of it as a game, can I? Because I'm at that point just doing connect the dots. I wonder how you get up there. It's probably a very, very simple answer. I just don't know it right now. Maybe I've got to do the seesaw trick and then, like, get it really high up. Or use the bouncy thing. There we go. I didn't think that would make it. Let's get the sock. 
And it's Patrick's sock, so who better to grab his own sock? Hey, this is mine. Yeah, it is yours. And it fucking reeks, apparently. Right, what else have we got up here that I missed? Some more shiny objects. Another jellyfish. Nope. And I guess that's the goo that we can't swim in. Probably. Okay, so let's go over to that um, weird fruit thing that I couldn't throw earlier. I think it was down there. Oh, I've got a bit of a climb to get back up. Yeah, it's over there. I can see it. The freeze cube. Oh, dear. Okay, well, at least we, this is why the teleportation boxes exist. I get it now, right. I didn't. I, I thought, like, well, if there's checkpoints, why are there teleportation boxes? It's not Dark Souls. Right, so we've got to pick it up and throw it, right. So then what do we do? Got ya, right. <laughs> oh, jeez. No, I'm running out of time. Go, 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 go. Fuck me. Shit. I was too, I was too entertained by his fucking doody do walking cycle. Hmm. This probably means I've got to go and get that sock again, isn't it? Oh no, it's been collected. Wait, did it work? Did I get it? Okay, let's go down here again. Right. Oh, I don't even. But the. But it said the checkpoint. I, I don't understand. So it says that the checkpoints. Okay, I can't do the uppy attack. Nightglow. So, so it says. Oh, it only saves the progress that you got up until the last. Oh, poor Patrick. Okay. I, well, first it was funny, but now I'm just upset. Oh dear. That's sad. What's he gonna do with his dick hands if he can't? If he's too scared, like, what's he gonna do? Right, so now I've got to find that. Oh, I thought I could close that. With my gargantuan frame. Yeah, anyway, I thought it said that it saved your progress up until the, the previous checkpoint. So, somehow it remembered that... Like, did I get a checkpoint after I picked up that, um, that sock? I don't know. Right, in the box. Where you belong. And we're right back at the top. Yeah, this is cool. I like this system. Okay. Roller Coaster Tycoon 3 is epic, not Rectum. Um, honestly, I've always thought, I've always wanted a full Kedekaris of Stuntman, but since there's only two games, I don't think it would work as well with your new content style. A, you're right, and B, I don't even know it as Stuntman. I think Driver's a way better name. I think that's the reason. Like, Driver did really, really well in this country. It did really, yeah, it did ridiculously well in this country. And, um, I think, I honestly think the Americans naming the game that is what caused it to not, not do as well. Ah, oh, I thought I'd get all of it. Shit. Bye, jellyfish. Oh, I was just going to say, his running animation was almost perfectly in time with the music. But his 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 belly is hypnotic. I love it. Ooh, we oh, we're back here. Okay, right. What? So did it not save any of this, or are these just respawned from when I quit the area? I don't know. Okay, what what do you want me to tell? What do you want me to do? Patrick can throw fruit up steps, then climb up the steps, pick up the fruit, and throw it again. Ah, I see. So he can't jump with it. That seems very situational. I thought it would have been a little bit more physics puzzle based than that. Okay. Oh, I see where this is going. Jump on the star. Anything I've missed here? Nope. Let's go. Oh, that was a very graceful landing, Patrick. I'm very impressed. 
You've been working out? Wait. Hang on a second. Okay, well then my my knowledge is fucked. I thought that Stuntman was the US version of Driver. Oh, I didn't realize you guys had that. I swear it wasn't just called Driver in the States. I swear it was called something else. Maybe I'm just being stupid. Yeah, thanks for letting me know now after I've already taken damage. Um, yeah, no, I thought that Driver was a... Com I thought Stuntman was the... Ugh, fuck it, I don't know what I'm talking about. I don't live in the States. Oh, fuck. No, no, I didn't want to do that. Whee! And... Plop. Very, very, very graceful. You alright, dude? Jesus. I thought he, I thought I absorbed him for a second. He went like when he... Oh, look! Patrick is assimilating. Um, I guess this is a case of throwing shit, but... Oh, hey, Plankton. Watch where you're going. The rock is talking to me. Oh, my dear rock, I am at your command. Thank you for Sleepy Osaka for the resubscription. Yes. Down here, best, that was the best comment of a resub comments. I've ever seen. Oh, hi there, Mr. Plankton. Are you going to vaporize me today? So very tempting. Unfortunately, I found myself in the undesirable position of having to assist you. I was in an undesirable position yesterday, and now my neck hurts. <laughs> you don't have a neck. Heed my words, my lord. Tubby little flubby. Vision. Go into Jellyfish Cave. Follow the instructions on the signs that you see. At the end of the caves, you'll still be a big pink idiot, but you'll know enough to help defeat the robots and get me back into the chum bucket. Doubt. Doubt. Oh, whoops. No. Okay, I was trying to do a joke and that didn't work. I just skipped the whole story. I'm now. I'm now not gonna have a clue what is going on. Yeah, I figured that. Yeah, he has the same controls as SpongeBob. That's fine. Okay. Uh. I don't think there's anything else around here. Let's continue. Ooh, oh. Oh, this is cool. Good lighting as well. Oh, oh, Lord. I'm being... Oh, Lord. I'm being... I oh, Lord. I'm going to the game over in a second. Ah, it's a jellyfish. Okay. I don't know if I was supposed to make that, but I did. Alright, let's get some more shiny objects. Nice. So I'm guessing this is more goop, isn't it? Sleepy Osaka. Caddy discovers hitting buttons does things in the video game. Oh, okay. What I was trying to do was hit a button that wasn't going to skip the cutscene. That's what I was trying to do, Sleepy Osaka. Smart ass. Why don't you have run a stream and try and make cutting edge comedy in the middle of your live reaction to gameplay from a game you've never seen before? Oh. Well, let's go now. This is safe. I don't think SpongeBob's underwear fits quite right. Don't need SpongeBob, it's fine. Can you pick these up? No, no, I doubt it. Okay, so be quick with this. Right, do I need to bring that anywhere here? What are you doing in here, jellyfish? That's a really dangerous place. I don't think there's anything else I can throw that at. No, we're good. Oh, well, that puts me in an awkward position. Oh, no. Whoa. I'm making noises to make it sound more tense than it actually is. Done it. Oh, jeez. Oh, I was about to get poked up my wrecked. Thank you so much, Hewlett Fan 96 for 50 bits. 
Hey, Caddy, loving the stream so far. This is the first stream after a month. I didn't want The Last of Us 2 spoiled. Also, would you consider reviewing Destroy Humans or a possible retrospective? There's not enough there for me to do, a, like, a full-on video about. But I was going to, um, after this and Ghost of Tsushima, I was going to have a look at the um, Destroy Humans remake. Because Destroy Humans 1, I've never played, I never played any other ones. I only played the first one. And I remember really enjoying it as a kid, but then I didn't play it again. Right, okay. Oh. So I need, my camera needs to be pointing at the thing I'm aiming at. Oh, I thought it was going to bang. Go. Go, Pat. Come on, Postman Patrick, let's go. Yeah. Pat smash. Oh, he can stack fruit. Okay. Oh, and I can pull myself up ledges. Cool. Right, so if I throw this on top of here. Ah, that's handy. Uh, no, no secrets up here. Ah, I saw a secret. Have you been lonely out there all along? No, get up there, Patrick. Yeah, I know. It's not the easiest thing for you to do. I mean, okay, yeah, it's situational and it's not physics-based, but I suppose that makes it way less frustrating and more fast-paced. Like, it would have been cool to have... Oh, God, I'm sliding. No, 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 no. I was not ready for the slide. No, okay, okay. No, it I, doesn't matter if I'm not ready. I'm doing it anyway. Let's go. Smash that. Smash it. Smash. Jump over the fire. Smash. No, don't hit them. Oh, damn. Okay. That was very, very scary. Whew. Ah, we got a teleportation box. That implies there was something to miss. Hmm. I wonder if there was something to miss. I'm going to slow down and see what I missed. Anything obvious? Anything that sticks out? I don't think so. No, I don't think there is. Okay, cool. I guess it's just a way to get us back to the... You guys are disgusting. You deserve to be down here in the depths. You come up to the surface, I'm going to fucking strangle you. How many of these do I have to carry? If he belly flops, he can damage or stun them. Yeah, oh, yeah, well, I've been doing that. That's a double jump. Oh, Lord! Ah! Oh! When did we start playing Subnautica? Th Jesus Christ. I'm, I'm more scared of that thing than anything in The Last of Us 2. That was a great combo, Pat. Well done. Thanks so much, Grimfang999, for the subscription. Very kind of you. Okay, smash, smash. And boom. Yeah. So what do I do with this fruit? I see. Right, so... I've got to go up these. Oh. Probably should have <laughs> dealt with them first, shouldn't I? Oh, that's a cheeky sneak of the peak. Right, okay, so I've got to... Right... Why does, why does Patrick have to collect underwear? Like, Spongebob, I, I get that, I suppose. Right, how am I going to do this? Hmm. Oh, right. Well, that, ex that explains everything. I should read. Oh, Lord. So how do I stun without destroying? Oh, I see. Right. Let's go. Throw, 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 throw. There we go. A lot less annoying than SpongeBob. That's f that's fine. Bye. Ah, uh, there's a smelly sock hiding there. So, time to freeze the water. Thank you, Bard Slinger, for the subscription. And Damien Castaway gifted a sub. Very kind of you. SpongeBob's underwear fits quite right. <laughs> yeah, so why do you use it for hit points? Oh, hey, look. It's Fangita lips. 
Oh, no. No, no. I shouldn't have called you that. No. Just as you were about to do that animation. No. Now I can never look at one the same way again. Thank you. Oh, my God. Look at Patrick's here. Whee! He's so happy. He's so happy that he froze the water. One dollar from Warsack One. Thank you so much. Do you remember Newgrounds? If so, what game do you play on it? Are we really at that point? Are we... Okay, I don't mean to sound horrible, but, like, are we at that point now where there are, there are people that like, are old enough to say, do you remember Newgrounds? Like, Newgrounds is still a thing, isn't it? It's not like some sort of cult TV show that happened in the 70s, is it? Or is it now considered that in internet years? Is Newgrounds now, like, ancient? Because I, I, I swear it's still going. <laughs> I don't know. The way you question, the way you phrase that question makes me feel, like, 80 years old. Thank you for the 100 bits of Patolni Kubus. Gex Switch has made me want a Gex Trilogy remake even more. Or at least Gex, or at least Gex 3 because it's the best one and 2 was kind of shit. Well, that's an interesting perspective to have. I'd much rather, if you're going to ask me to get rid of any of them, I'd get rid of the first one. Can we get up here? Yeah, there we go. So, we are now in our next area. Ahoy there. Squidward tells the fuck me are you doing here? Jellyfish. Yes. Good thing, too. That monster has been stinging all my good customers in their poop decks. That is so I I'm sorry. I know harping on it. That is such a bad impression. Oh, hook that beast, sailor. Oh, boy, Mr. Krabs. I'll see what... Like, are you, are you trying to do pirate? Or are you trying to do farmer? Or are you trying to do British-Irish? Like, what are you trying to do? Hey, my back feels better. Oh, God. What the hell is that? It's sick in a bottle. Oh, it's tartar sauce. Oh, nice. Well, I love tartar sauce, but not when it's yellow. Imitation crab. 100 bits from Classy One. Okay. What's up here? Nothing. Okay. Let's keep looking around then. Tartar. It's tartar. Stupid Americans. Tartar, -tar, Legos. Oh my god. Every, every every fucking resident down here deserves to be shot. What is going on with this guy's mouth? <laughs> fucking hell. Oh god, it's like it's like it's like um it's like one of the sock muppets, but then someone decided to cut all the way down someone's arm. So now it's like an entire What is this? This is horrifying. A oh, there's a there's a sneaky red shiny object. I, I hope that was worth it. I risked my life for that one. Inflim, do you want to know how I got these scars? <laughs> yeah, I think we can all agree. Joaquin Phoenix shouldn't have been the Joker. That there's our Joker right there. Oh god, I thought I was gonna like split. Like if someone grabbed the top half of his head, they could break his back with his with the top half of his face. Like think about that for a second. Oh Jesus, I didn't realize they attacked. Oh, is that it's Mrs. Mrs. St Mrs. Pump? What's her name? Hello, Mrs. Puff. Puff. Mrs. Pump! Hello, Patrick. <laughs> it's been so long since I watched SpongeBob. I found a golden spatula. Mrs. Pump, the driving instructor. Oh, don't worry. We won't need any new tires. I'll just pump them up with my pump. 
I mean, come on. It's a puffer fish. She she pumps up, right? She go. She pumps. I mean, I guess you could say she puffs as well, but I'd say that she pumps. Fucking Mrs. Pump, right? Oh, we can swap characters now. Thank God, I was getting sick of Patrick's bloody. Yeah, yeah, Patrick's bloody, like waddling. I can't take it. Like, let's just switch. Oh, that was a cool. Yeah, that was cool. I like that. Oh, I thought I could jump on top of that. So, do we get different dialogue? You haven't been driving. <laughs> Of not, Mrs. Puff. I don't even have a license. Oh, good. Then it was just another bad dream. Now, that's the that's the old voice actress, isn't it? Like, that sounds like her. Oh, so I, I broke the game earlier then. So it's it's sound that annoys... Okay, so all, those, all that time I was doing my stupid jumpy, like... Yeah, you can do it. You can do it either way. You can either... Yeah, you can do it that way, or you can do it the way the game wants you to. But if you want to be cool, like me, do it that way. Luna Tofu, 100 bits. I'm giving you all of these fucking bits because Mrs. Pump made me laugh way harder than it should have. <laughs> oh my god, you're right, they do have the game. Okay, so, that re yeah, okay, so that's reminded Keris, who's now reminded me. So, the kids have this, what, what's the card game that they play? Dinosaur Snap, but is it is it is there like a, ba a basic version of it you could do with a normal deck of cards? Is it just Snap? It's Snap, but there's like a spare a card that goes around, isn't there? There's a, a donkey, right? So there's a card game Donkey or something along those lines. Oh, I should probably wait. Oh, I should be Patrick, shouldn't I? Okay. So anyway, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. So um. So anyway, the kids have this game. They play their own version of Donkey with um, playing cards. And the playing cards that we just so happen to have are playing cards of Game of Thrones characters. And so the Donkey is the Joker, right? Yeah, that's what I'm saying. But the do in the game, the Donkey is the Joker. So the Donkey in the game is the Joker. And basically, you want to play Snap, but not let the... Um, Oh, I was jumping on them earlier. That's weird. Yeah, you want you want to play snap. You're playing snap, but you don't want to be left with the donkey while you d deal your cards around and shit. So anyway, um, but they they don't call it donkey or whatever else anyone else calls it. They call it Mr. Pump Pump. I don't know why they call it Mr. Pump Pump, but basically basically Mr. Pump Pump is Peter Baelish. So whenever we see Peter Baelish, he's Mr. Pump Pump. Oh, and if you lose the game, you're wife of Pump Pump. Okay, right, yeah. That's an important detail of the game that they don't tell you about in poker. If you lose, you're Mrs. Pump Pump. Yes, even if you're a guy, you're Mrs. Pump Pump. That's just that's just how the, that's just how that's just how the rules are. I don't make them up. Yeah, she, Amy really hates losing Mr. Pump Pump, doesn't she? Peter Baelish is Mr. Pump Pump. It sounds like a kind of film trailer. Peter Baelish is Mr. Pump Pump in Driving Mrs. Pump. <laughs> oh, fuck you. Fuck. Stun. Pick you up and throw you into the cubicle. Harper Onions, 100 bits. Can you say hi to Keris for me, Caddy? Hi, Keris, says Harper Onions. She says hi, Harper Onions. Uh, who wants to play Pump Pump indeed? I think Patrick wants to. I want to play Pump Pump. Oh boy, it's my favorite game! Hey, Mrs. Pump, how you doing? Well done, Patrick. You're a real star. <laughs> oh, very funny. Did I get a cookie? No. <laughs> Fuck you, then. Can you make her blo balloon up if we annoy her enough? That's another episode I remember. I don't know if it was a later season or an early season, but it's when SpongeBob's taking his driving lessons and he's got a, a hat on that has, like, a, a radio inside it. 
and the radio is inside his head, and they're t and they and they're giving him instructions, and he get and he feels guilty. So he he's in the middle of the driving test, and then confesses that he's cheating, and then crashes the car, and she blows up to the size of a house. I think that's an early episode. It has been such a long time. I think they're on Amazon Prime. All of the um. Well, I remember enjoying all of the early season ones. I don't I don't particularly like the new ones that I've seen, but the, the old ones are great. I'd, I'd watch them again, if the kids were up for that. I think, yeah, the first one I ever saw was on a Saturday morning. And it was the one with the jellyfish and Squidward being stung. And then, like, them shoving the, the net deep into his, into his bandage hand. Firmly grasp it. <laughs> that one. I always thought that was fucking hilarious. So that's uh, that's the first one I that's the first one I saw, and I remember even when I was like, I don't know how old I was when it first aired, but I remember thinking in, like, this is like if I was drunk, this is like the best Hangover TV ever. And as far as I understand now, it's not quite like that. It's a little bit flanderized. Oh, you're sending a text to Phoebe that says that she's Mrs. Pump Pump. She's not going to like that, you know that. Oh, you got to walk past without saying howdy? Is that a bow tie or your beard? Or is your moustache another part of your bow tie? Oh my god, Patrick got erect. Fucking hell! What? <laughs> I wasn't expecting that! Patrick got erect and then screamed in agony. <laughs> I think he needs to see the doctor about that one. Fucking hell! Oh no, tartar sauce! It's it's coom! Get rid of it! Get rid of the coom gun! Oh! Once he uses the cruise bubble move, I don't know what that is. Did you hear about Argos getting rid of their catalogs? Tickle my pickle. Oh my god, tickle the pickle! That's what we play with Stan. Thanks for the one dollar. Yeah, not in a, we don't play tickle his pickle, we play tickle the- because we call him Stanley Pickles, we tickle the pickle. You just say, tickle to pickle, and then just, like, keep making noises at him, and then he eventually bites your fingers. Um, no, I did hear about Argos closing off their catalogue, and I can't be any- pl Like, I've got fond memories of looking through the catalogues and everything, but if you've been to an Argos recently, they're very overpriced, their- their selection isn't as good as something like Amazon. And to be completely blunt with you, um, wait, can you sneak as well? <laughs> no, you can't. Yeah, to be completely blunt as well, like, sh shit needs to move on, you know? This one goes boom. Times have to move on, and I've got fond memories of Ar Argos catalogs, and I want them to stay fond instead of them going on for way longer than they should have and, like, becoming a joke of themselves. And plus, it saves a ton of paper. Like, everyone does their shit online anyway. I'm not that bothered about it. go. Not yet. Well, not actually. If you go into an Argos store now as well, like, all the pay- like, it's very cool that, like, you can go through the catalogue and order your thing and it's magically in your hands a few seconds later. That shit's fun. But, like, it's still very much, um, oh, I can't see. It can be blown up by Thunder Tiki's. Okay, right. Yeah, it's still very much, like, all the pages are laminated. And they're all greasy, and there's sticky kids' fingers over them, and especially with the virus shit going on, I can't imagine. I think that's probably why they got rid of it. Saving saving costs, saving the planets, and um, making sure that um, they don't spread their dust disgusting children fingers everywhere. Because I reckon there's going to be a few people that died from coronavirus purely from dirty Argos catalogs. I would not be surprised. Right, so if we... Oh, I see. You're behind there. I didn't know where you were. Awesome. Right, how do we get over there? Oh, no. Go away. Thank you so much. 100 bits, Damien Castaway. While looking up if there is indeed someone with the name Mr. Pump Pump, I've learned that it's a Scottish slang for tap water. Wait. Oh no, no, he's learnt that the, t the that the Scottish slang for tap water is council juice. Council juice, yeah. I was gonna say, because you have to pay for water from yeah, I guess that makes sense. Council juice. Sounds disgusting. 
Oh my fucking lord, what was that? What? What the hell happened? I didn't realize that they did that. Okay. I was just trying to get over there. I wasn't wasn't trying to do anything scandalous. Oh, whatever. Do they not stay there forever then? No. I'm very lost. I probably wasn't paying that much attention. There we go. No, no. There we go. Sorted. Bye. 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 See you later. Boom. Boom. There we go. Look at that. I'm swimming in pants. Fuck. Alright, what can I throw you at? How do you get up there? Oh, oh, so I've got to keep going forward. Oh, so they don't stay up forever. Oh, I didn't realize they were timed platforms. Oh, right. God, that really confused me. I was like, well... Yeah, that was really confusing. Because <laughs> it's like, the, like if it was one of those ones where the, the platforms don't stay there forever and you have to move, I would, I would fi I'd be fine with that. But it's the fact that like the middle platform disappeared as I was jumping on it, so I didn't really know what I was doing wrong. Can I make this jump? Yeah, no problem. So, oh, I just jumped into the chat quickly. Skidaro is asking, how am I liking the remake so far? I think this is good. It's standard collectathon shit, but it's solidly constructed. I haven't really got any complaints so far. There's a couple of, like, flaws here and there, but... Yeah, like not being able to move the camera in certain areas and shit like that, but no, it's good. I never played the original, so I couldn't tell you how much better or worse it is. Boom. Oh. I think I'm the only player in the world that has ever done that. Okay, alright. Okay, that's where I was down earlier. Thanks, Alice of Wonderland, for the subscription. Or resub, rather. Thank you. Right, so then it expects me to go down here. Right, okay. I'm I'm with you. So there's a couple of socks and things we are going to miss, logically, purely because um we haven't got all the abilities yet. Yeah, I think the the out yeah, I think so far the only things that annoy me are that you can't move the camera everywhere in some places and the um checkpoint system does not work in tangent with where some um, certain out-of-bounds areas are. Like, it's not clear where some out-of-bounds areas are. And to be immediately punished, not even given a few seconds to get away, to be immediately punished and then sent back to your last checkpoint where you then have to pick up every single collectible you grabbed again is kind of harsh. Because you can't actually tell where all of the... Oh, I need to be SpongeBob. Shit. Oh, no, I don't need to be SpongeBob. I can just do what I usually do. My, my break of the game. I can see why this has a good speedrunning community. I think there are loads of things you could do to break this game. It just feel it just feels like a very breaky kind of game. Is that all of them? I think I got all of them. Wait. Ten? It says I've got thirteen. Guys, is it glitched? It says I've got 10 socks, but I but it says I've also got 13. Or did I spend some and I didn't realize it? I don't remember spending any unless I did. Oh, oh, in total. Oh, I thought that was just for this area. Oh, thank you guys. Thanks. Thanks for clearing that up. I thought that was just for this area. I was very confused there. Yeah, I did get some socks in the hub world. I didn't realize it was giving my entire totals. Oh, fuck you guys. I don't care. Okay, this is probably where the game wants me to switch to Spongebob, right? See, that's something that's going to get a little bit annoying as the game goes on, I think, as well. I think it's... I think there are going to be moments where 
you're not you're not gonna know who which character to be, and then you're gonna have to backtrack through. I've I say okay. I when it comes to backtracking, I've got I've got an interesting history with backtracking. I think backtracking is great. I think it's I think it's a great way to to build the world. I think it's a great way to get familiarized with the design of some aspects of some game worlds. I, I think I think that backtracking is great. Like in Resident Evil games, backtracking is incredible. I love it. Um, and like even Metal Gear Solid, like it's it's technically reusing content, but you're still doing the same gameplay. It's still the same level of like challenge but when you when you don't know who you need for the future parts until later and then you need to go back find the next the nearest box and there's no enemies and there's no yeah you're still jumping and everything around but backtracking that doesn't serve any extra purpose to the game itself is what i have a problem with and that doesn't serve any extra purpose to the game other than just extending it um and it's it's, it's unfair as well because you don't know what you're gonna need at what point so but that's a small thing. It's not gonna it's not gonna completely ruin anything, but it wants me to do something with that ice cube, but I don't know what. Hmm, there's probably a secret area down here somewhere. See if I can freeze this. Hmm. Okay, let's try again. Get a little bit closer to the edge. There? Nope. Okay, maybe I've got to go down a ledge then. Uh, that, that, oh, that should do it. Oh, fuck off. <laughs> oh. oh, Phoebe replied. A oh, Amy's Mrs. Pump Pump. Okay, right, here we go. Right, so I do freeze that. There has to be a reason. Because I can't see any big bodies of water that I would benefit from freezing that's this close to the area, so... Hmm, maybe there isn't a reason. I don't know, guys. Um, let's... I don't want to jump all the way down here and have it all for nothing. I really don't want that shit. But there might be a secret down there. Hmm... Okay, no, I'm gonna, I'm going to take the bullet. Let's do it. What the fuck? Oh, God, no! I didn't want you to do that either. Oh my God, this is way harder than it has any right to be. So if, should I, should I drop down? What happens if I drop down? Right, there's got to be something around here. <laughs> Whee! No, I bet you I'm wasting my time. Oh, is there a secret behind the waterfall? I guess I'll never know. Fuck. Uh, where's the where's the cardboard box to take me back up? Where is it? There it is. At least I've got that. Um, I don't know what that's there for. I'm sure it'll make more sense as we go on. But there's nothing down here. Yeah, that doesn't take you anywhere. I'm looking at the river pattern. There's nothing down there that suggests. I looked through the waterfall. There wasn't anything there. So maybe I changed the level at some point. Are we on a giant chocolate sprinkle baguette? What the fuck are we on right now? Don't look down, Patrick. Don't look down. <laughs> I look... Right, let's carry on. I love body slamming in games. It's so much fun. It's one of my favorite things to do in Lego games. Like jump jumping and attack like attacking while in the air and doing that big area of attack landing thing because it smashes everything around you. It's just the best way to deal with enemies and get all the Lego studs you need all in one go. So much fun. Right. Ah, uh, so there's a bus stop there. Oh shit me. It's the fucking San Francisco bridge made out of bread. Okay, right, so if we go this way. Oh fuck, fuck. Okay. We can't we can't even touch the water. Okay. What does this do? SpongeBob can wall jump. Okay. Gotcha. Oh, that's where we came from. 
Oh, right. Okay, so I'm going to switch out. Just asking, guys, is, is the game running smoothly for you on my stream? I've just looked at um, Streamlabs. It's not running smoothly. It's running at, like, half the speed it should. It should be running way smoother. Sorry, wait a second. I'm just sorry. I, I know I'm, I'm going to quit the game for a second. It seems to be varying. Okay, well, I'll just, I'll just make sure... I'll just double-check that there's... Yeah, it should be it should be at 60, but I was just looking at the screen and it looked about 30, so I'm just making sure that it's doing the right things it should be. All right, what are the properties of my display capture? Mm, okay. All right. Is it running at 60 for you guys? Yeah, that, that's the thing. Huh. That's weird. I need to work that out, don't I? My what? My yeah. My webcam is moving at sixty. That's how it. Sh that's how the game should be running. That's how smooth it should be running, and it's not. It's running that smooth for me, but I don't think it's running that smooth on the street. No, it's not. It's running at thirty. What the fuck? It should not be running like that. It's running really smoothly for me. What the fuck? That's really annoying. That's really annoying. Okay. Yeah, it should be running way fucking smoother than that. That is really annoying. I need to work out what's going on with that. For next time. I'll, g I'll get to the end of this level and then I'll call it a night and then work out what the fuck else I have to do. Right, let's do some wall jumping. Yeah, I know how to wall jump. You just told me. Nice. Oh no, you don't want to do that. No, you don't want to do that either. Oh, King Jellyfish is up here. God, we're nearly at the we're nearly at the end game, guys. I'm glad. I'm glad that. I'm glad you guys are saying that this, the the um frame rate isn't a problem for you. It's a problem for me though because I want these to be as high quality as possible. Step quietly there. That king jellyfish is just up at the top of this path. Good luck. You. Thanks, Bubble Butt. I thought we had to pop you. Ah, fuck. Fresh like a spring breeze. Yeah, the game runs like way smoother than the stream is giving it credit for. This is really irritating, and it's annoying as well because. Um, it's annoying as well because, um, yeah, J Doom Eternal ran at 60 on the stream, so that's really weird. Here we go. Slap him! Okay. I, I, I'm... Wow, Space Hamster's playing Dark Souls 3 right now, while well, I'm playing something way, way harder. King Jellyfish. Slap him. I wonder how we do that. I can't touch that. That's goop, isn't it? All oh, right. So he loses his electricity when he when he butt slams, I guess. Right. There you go. So I can't touch him like this. But I have to wait for him to. It's a tiny tiger situation then. No, not tiny tiger. What the fuck am I talking about? There's a boss level that does that. You have to wait for them to, to, to stomp before you hit. Tiger, tiny, tiny Tiger just runs out of energy, but this is a... Fuck. I'm jumping a bit too uh, late there. There we go. Oh god, I thought that said fucking slap! <laughs> Thanks for the 50 bits, Doggod128. Oh, we got blue jellyfish. These are new. 
What do these guys do? Nothing? Ah, oh, that's the shit I need. Okay, now it's running at 60. How does streaming work, chat? What? Why? Why? Why when I'm trying to explain myself to you about my quality stream, why does it then go for 30, 30 to 60? Like... Why? Why does it have to be made this difficult for me? I didn't do anything. I didn't change any settings. The stream is sentient. I can't control the frames it's given us. It's too powerful. I mean, yeah, so this is how it should be running. So now you can see what I'm seeing. This is what I've been seeing all this time. Oh, lordy lord. Right, what's here? Ah, nice. So we can teleport all the way back up here if we want to. Looks like there's a, there's a slide section here. Ah, my favourite, poo in a jar. Okay, let's do it. I noticed as well it said that the... Um, That's how we do it in my garden. That is how we do it in my garden. Thank you so much, Slowpunk, for the resub. I'm going to keep my eye open for... um Secret passages and shit. Oh, fuck. Fuck. Fuck! Oh. Oh. Well, that happened. How do I get up there? Oh, wait. It wants me to go this way for... Where the hell are you going, Sponge? What? Judge? Fuck! What? Oh, God. The game shat its pants. What the hell happened there? Thanks, Iron Ninja, for the 100 bits. I enjoy category streams. They're quite entertaining. Not because of the gameplay or the commentary, but the stream problems. <laughs> okay. Don't rub it in. Fucking bit bit licker. I know I know your bit game, Iron Ninja. I know you like getting them out. I know. You can't keep it a secret. So you can you can make jokes about the performance issues I'm having on my stream right now, but at the end of the day, I don't get my bits out in front of public. Right, so I think we've got to go around in a circle around here somewhere. Is my guess. Or not. What? Okay, I need to find out where the... Oh, Lord, my God. Shit in my bed. I, I'm, I've got nothing. I've got nothing. Hey, babe, wanna, wanna, wanna take me out? I can show you a good time. <laughs> It is a boob fish that has had too much to drink. Yeah, that's what that's what we're looking at right now. Right, I'm gonna work out the secrets of this stupid jellyfish slide. There has to be some sort of secret area I missed. Ah, there it is. No, 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 SpongeBob, how do you physics yourself backwards? Come on! What? The fuck is going on? <laughs> what are you doing? Captain Birdseye, take me to the beginning. No, don't put me back there! SpongeBob, I'm, I've, I've soft locked the game. I can't get out of this. <laughs> the game joined in with the drunk fish lady. Oh, I saved myself. Oh, Lord. Wait, wait. Oh, I can't go that way anyway. Oh, fuck off. Sock getter. Did I get all the socks here? No, I just got um, however many I've got. 50. I've got 15 in total. Okay, right. Oh, my God. That was horrible. Spatula seeker and sock getter. Great. Fucking hell. But you know what? Like, you can... You can 
judge the quality of a game based on glitches and shit like that. But if it if it if it's genuinely entertaining and doesn't ruin the experience and doesn't completely impede progress, then it's fine. And if it's not constant. See, no problem. You can do anything you set your mind and your muscle to. Thanks for clearing that up, Larry. It's the first time I'm seeing you, so I don't know why you're giving me this motivational speech now. Wait, do you shrink when I jump on you? You do! You don't even fall over, you just shrink. Nice. And I suppose you look just as abominable as everything else? Yep, of course you do. Fucking hell, what... What is going on with these character models? I know they're, I know they're like, from the show, but they look so much b less freaky in 2D. In, th in 3D, they look hellish. Look at this shit. Look at this shit. Do you want to eat that with chips? Because I don't. Right, let's get out of here. Oh, Lord. Here we go. Here's your jellyfish juice. Oh, that feels so much better. Anything for my best friend Squidward. Can I rub some on? What about Patrick? I thought Patrick was your best friend. What if I just gave you this? Why doesn't everybody just give me all of their fucking get spatulas and then we, we won't have a problem? Wait, can someone remind me why the hell we are getting spatulas? I thought you were trying to stop the robots. What do we need the spatulas for? I'm so I'm so worked up with everything else the game's doing. I'm, I'm, I'm completely forgotten why the fuck we're even doing what we're doing. I know there's plankton and the robots, but why are we getting golden spatulas? To get to the chum bucket, thank you. Thanks for reminding me. Fucking hell. I forgot we're doing this for fucking Plankton. This is Crash 2 all over again. We're doing this for... But except, instead of doing it for Cortex over here, we're doing it for... This dude. Thank you so much, How Original, for the gifted subs. Get ready for an onslaught of... That's how we do it in my garden. Uh, and How Original himself has subscribed. Or herself, sorry. I'm not sure. Here's to one of my favorite YouTubers. Stay beautiful. So, well, you too. Do you want to trade shiny objects for a golden spatula? Yes, and I'd like for you to change your voice actor, governor. That's quality craftsmanship, that is. Right, I'm just going to buy all of his shit in one go. So let me guess, the next one's going to be six grand? So, do you want that? Oh no, okay. So the next one's going to be four grand then, which I don't have enough of. And he's going to tell me to fuck off. Your treasure chest yeah, okay. Looking a bit so then the that means the next thing to do after that is going to downtown Bikini Bottom, I guess. Sweet. I'm guessing the game saves itself? Doesn't... S oh, save game. Fuck. Yeah, let's save my game right now. Oh, my goodness gracious. Okay, well, I'm going to call the stream off there. Um, but thank you so much for joining me, everybody. Hopefully, it won't. this won't... I'm, I'm probably going to do um, a level a session, but... Um, oh, Ifrit Design! Hi, Cat. It's been a while. I'm so sorry that I'm closing the stream off. Sorry for all of the um, um, technical problems and stuff. Um, it's been a while since I've streamed from PC, as you can tell. Um, last time I did that was Doom Eternal, which was back in March. So six plus months ago. So sorry about that. But um, yeah, um, thanks for coming down, everybody. This was a good time. And this is a little bit more fun to react to and talk about and interact with you guys on than Last of Us Part 2, which is mostly just cry fodder and making you question if you should take a blade to your own wrists. So, yeah, there we go. But, there we go. Thanks so much for joining in, everybody. I'm going to have to do the ugly alt-tabbing and um, get back out of the game. And I'm going to have to close the stream off from here. Thank you so much for joining in, everybody. And I'll see you in two days' time. Wednesday, Monday, Wednesdays, and Fridays, 10pm BST. Convert it into your own time zone, because I can't be buggered.